So Convent's approach to generative AI has three components to it. First is we will be acting as enablers where we want to leverage market leading technologies to enhance our solutions and our operations. Uh, the second component is the focus uh, of our generative AI efforts. So we are not focused on replacing humans. We really want to harness the power of generative AI to assist and enable humans and to really unlock innovative and additive opportunities uh, for creating uh, high value business outcomes. The third is, as we are thinking about the use cases, we are really keeping a lens of uh, business process value chain and we are evaluating generative AI against the benefits we can create in this value chain. And we are focused on three uh, primary benefits. One is improved quality, increased productivity, and third, faster cycle times. So when we look at use cases across Conduit's portfolio, we can really put them in three buckets. The first is documents management. So applying generative AI for uh, analysis uh, or, and summarization of information for faster decision making process. Uh, the second is um, applying generative AI for improving uh, the, the quality of data extraction from structured and unstructured documents. So we are as an example, we are looking to deploy generative AI to improve uh, the claims adjudication process in the healthcare space, where we want to be able to improve uh, the quality of data extractions from the healthcare forms, being able to identify pendant claims early on, uh, being able to really summarize uh, correspondence documents, which are highly unstructured for faster decision making uh, for our clients. The second category is the user interaction category, where we we want to be able to apply generative AI based um, uh, chatbots, virtual assistants to really help our customer service agent respond to customer queries faster, really increasing uh, the agent productivity. The third is the search and analytics category. So really using generative AI for indexing of information, searching of information across vast sets of structured and unstructured information, and then really applying context-based analytics for pattern recognition. So we are looking uh, to deploy generative AI for uh, increasing the speed uh, and, and volume of fraud detection in our government payment business. So unlike other competitors, diversity of conduits portfolio really creates multiple angles to pursue generative AI. Uh, we support end-to-end -end business processes for a variety of our clients in the government space, transportation space, and commercial space. And we can really look at these business uh, processes and can, we can target generative AI to create benefits like improved quality, increased productivity, faster cycle time. Uh, secondly, uh, because we offer solutions in uh, BPAS model, we can really embed generative AI at the process uh, level. We can also embed generative AI as part of our key technology platforms. Uh, lastly, we can solve uh, lots of the business challenges using generative AI across a variety of industries and domains like healthcare, payments, uh, government, etc. So all of these different angles really create multiple use cases for us and we can really bring the breadth and experience from these use cases for our customers. So Conduit is really committed uh, to be working uh, with large technology providers, leading technology providers in the generative AI space, uh, such that we are able to bring right and relevant solutions for our clients that fits their unique uh, business process environment. Uh, our uh, collaboration with Microsoft on generative AI is an example of that commitment. Uh, we recently launched an innovation initiative with our long-standing partner Microsoft around generative AI where we want to use Azure's open AI capabilities. Uh, we are really going to work with Microsoft in a programmatic, collaborative way across multiple use cases. We have already launched three pilots uh, the first one is in the healthcare claims adjudication space. 
The second one is in increasing the uh, volume um, and speed of fraud detection in our government payment space. And lastly, we are also looking uh, to deploy generative AI uh, to increase customer service agent productivity. For Conduent, um, these benefits translate into increasing the competitiveness of our solutions by deploying generative AI, uh, increasing the efficiency of our business process operations in support of those solutions. And lastly, we believe we can open new adjacencies across that value chain, such which will then allow us to uh, go after new revenue opportunities.